something particularly pleasing was happening for the Bohemian Grovers with whatever developed with that crowd uh, of men in black and brown and the bound body on the back of the buggy. They drove behind big black tarps they had hanging out of the trees. There was lots of smacking on lips of in, in bizarre enjoyment by the crowd. We still haven't made out exactly what was going on, but that a real sacrifice may have actually been developing according to some occult experts. All the time in the darkness across the small lake, uh, the men in black were doing something behind the dark curtains hanging from the redwood trees. Then after about 10 more minutes of music, suddenly all around the owl activity began. Here is the main central part of the ritual. The owl is in his leafy temple. Let all within the grove be reverent before him. Lift up your heads, O ye trees, and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting spires. For behold, here is Bohemian shrine, and holy are the pillars of this house. Give to you her kiss. 
so must he come as children. Little children that believe, nor ever doubt her beauty and her faith, nor deem her tenderness can change or die. Here you have the boatman, his face painted up like a skull, bringing the bound body across the water. Again, we'll have enhanced video of this later. And uh, let's see if you can pick up all of the different occultic meanings uh, in the speeches you're about to hear. Our fellowship bans thee for a space. 
time of levelance, which would pursue us here, has lost its power under these friendly trees. So shall we burn thee once again this night, and the flames that keep thine effigy, we shall read the sign that Midsummer sets us free. He shall burn me once again! <laughs> These flames, which hither ye have brought from regions where I reign, ye fools and priests, I spit upon your fire. Wow. Listen to all mortal wisdom. Thou of Bohemia, we beseech thee. Grant us thy counsel.
Upon further research of the ritual you just witnessed, it becomes clear. It is a mixture of the Babylonian Canaanite cult of Moloch fused with ancient Druidic rites where you have the female side of Satan, which they first call out to in the she, and then towards the horn god with the he, mixed with Masonic rites from Scotland. It's very likely that many of the 1,500 to 2,000 member crowd had really no idea what they were actually watching because it was thinly veiled. Here we have some more enhanced video as the boatman, again with his face painted up like a skull, pulls his boat uh, across the small lake towards the high priest with the red of his cloak visible with his hand outstretched as if he is pulling the damned soul towards him as they throw off their cares, their conscience for what they have to do in the world. Also, you have the arrangement of the circle of higher level priests around him, the high priest in lighter colors, and then the outer rooms of red, and then those in black. Uh, this is consistent uh, with the darker workings of the occult, not just with the Western uh, countries, but also worldwide. Now, when you see that black edge coming to the field, that's because we zoomed in on the video, and many times the picture was almost out of the screen, so that's the edge of the field or the view of the camera. Wow. Prince of all mortal wisdom. 
Our Bohemia, we beseech thee, grant us thy counsel. Our Bohemia, we thank thee for thy adjuration. There you see the funeral pyre burning uh, with the effigy of a human, or it could be real, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, there's been a lot of strange going-ons in that area of Northern California, but this is what the establishment is into uh, right here in America, the cremation of care. And this was July 15th, 2000. These people are deadly serious, those taking part in the ceremony. Another point, the pyrotechnics you're seeing going off uh, were being released from beneath little rod iron crosses about a foot and a half tall. Also, notice the screams of pain coming uh, from the sacrifice. Be gone, do care. Fire shall have its will of thee. Be gone, do care. And all the winds make merry with thy nuts. Hail, fellowship's eternal flame. Once again, midsummer sets us free. <laughs> One of the facets of the ritual that goes deeply into the occult, again, we've already mentioned the druids at their bone fires or bonfires throwing, throwing bodies into fiery pits after ritually cutting their hearts out or slitting their throats. They talk about reading the sign in the burning effigy, reading the sign. Again, research your history books on the occult, even the encyclopedia Britannica on what the Druids would engage in. Um, this is just unbelievably macabre and evil. I would only hope that the people of the world realize the organized evil we're dealing with at almost every level. Republican, Democrat, you name it. They're all working on the same team. Ladies and gentlemen, it's called world government, the new world order, dehumanization. It's not a joke, it's deadly serious. 
Unfortunately, they've been breeding societies to think everything's a joke. I'm here to tell you truth is stranger than fiction.